If you or your partner is thinking about getting a vasectomy, I think one of the most important things to consider uh, is that you're not actually sterile until you've had 10 to 20 uh, ejaculations after the procedure. So I think it's very important that you continue to use protection until we prove that you're actually sterile with a semen analysis afterwards. The other thing you should know is that it's a very safe, um, typically almost painless uh, procedure that can be done in the office uh, and that the recovery is often, you know, five to seven days after that. Vasectomies do not affect a man's sexual function at all other than making it impossible for him to get somebody pregnant. They don't affect sex drive or your testosterone level or the volume of the ejaculate. The only way that we would know that a man has had a vasectomy is to actually look under a microscope and see whether or not there's sperm there. They are reversible. The reversals work about 90 to 95 percent of the time, although I would counsel couples that, you know, if, if they're at all on the fence about, you know, having children in the future, they probably should not have a vasectomy. If you're interested in getting a vasectomy, uh, your next steps would be to call the University of Utah Urology Clinic and schedule a consultation, and we would be uh, happy to see you and perform an evaluation. Mm -hmm.